friend rise and scorpios and welcome back for another scorpio love reading this is whatever comes out is what it is now you know we're gonna get these readings in scorpios everybody's situation is not the same so hopefully this will bring clarity of truth for someone here in particular so what is a message for scorpios what does scorpio need to know the most at this current time what does scorpios need to know currently for their highest good. Show me Scorpios. What do they need to know the most pertaining to their relationship and their person? What do they need to be made aware of currently for their highest good? Please like, share, and subscribe. Scorpios, I appreciate you. I really, 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 really do. Oh, you're about to be extremely happy, emotionally fulfilled. Knight of Pentacles. Look, someone is slowly making their way in. Somebody's coming in to offer you some stability. Ace of Cups here. Spirits, they don't pay attention to the negative thoughts. Just know that you got, you're about to be happy. Somebody's going to bring you a beautiful offer of emotional fulfillment. Could be a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. Could be a new person here. Ooh. The Empress. I feel like somebody's going to spoil you, mama. Somebody may invite you out to a spa day with this Knight of Pentacles and Nine of Cups. You, somebody may take you on the spa where y'all sipping on some, you know, some grapes and, you know, y'all, you know, they massaging you. Somebody may treat you to, because uh, the Empress is catered. She's pampered. She's high maintenance, okay? She's, she's substance. Nah, she's fertile. She's very, very abundant. She's sophisticated. She's sensual. She's feminine. She like all that feminine. You could, could be a mother. Somebody may be finding out that they're with child with this Ace of Cups and the Empress. Ooh, but they go to Queen of Swords, though. But y'all ain't playing no games, though, huh? So for some of y'all, y'all guarded towards an air sign or towards a soulmate. Or maybe this time, if you're relaxing and pampering yourself, you're going to be more disciplined with your emotions for the next. Because you got a soulmate here. So I feel like you're going to be more open, but you're going to be more logical here. Because this empress has learned some things. And y'all going to start handling these, these, these deep connections that you meet. You're not going <laughs> to, y'all ain't going to hurry up and throw that cup in. Now y'all going to take the time to talk, communicate, analyze them. And you're going to know immediately if this offer is for you because we're dealing with an empress. It's almost like you got folks coming in that's um, rehearsing or trying out for a position, okay? You, you're trying out people for positions here. And your logical side is going to be the one that's going to make that, that tough decision, all right? Because you got soulmate energy coming your way, opportunities to start something new. See, they go to Page of Cups. Could be something new, some a secret crush, beginning stage of somebody could be trying to come back in and apologize and make something right. Could be a soulmate. This is what you don't see. Uh, this is what you don't know. Somebody here who has been stressing out. <laughs> <laughs> somebody here who ain't sleeping good at night because somebody want to come offer an apology to you, but they know you and that queen of swords, you ain't going to play. They're slowly coming in here, though, to heal it or to make things right because they're going to star card. It's like somebody has tapped into your femininity here. Some of y'all real see because somebody don't like this part of you. See, you got somebody feeling cold and left out and they can't sleep. The bed feel like a bed of bricks and and, and somebody feel like they're going to have to come in and make it right. See, there it is. Judgment. So your person is waking up, Scorpio. Your person is making up their mind, even though they're scared because they know you don't play. But check it out, Scorpios, even though you may not play and you're handling things the way you are, all the thing is going to make somebody do is respect you because somebody's looking at you like you don't play no game. So when people look at you like you're going to stand up for yourself and you can see right through the mess, they're not going to be so quick to try to hustle you. They're going to either come right by you, you know, because sometimes people try you, you know, sometimes people try to see how much you're going to put up with or how much you know. But some of y'all, you gain tight, god dang it, with that emphasis. It's almost like, I don't need you. What? Say what? You know you ain't playing. See that logical side. Not that queen of cups. That queen of swords ain't going to play. And you know you're going to stand on business because you know you deserve it. And you can stand on it because your ancestors got you. Because you done learned a lot of things uh, from your emotions. And now you're going to use it to your advantage. And you're going to let nobody push you over. Because your soul may finna complete their case to you. And they scared. <laughs> 
but they know if they don't want to freeze, they're going to have to bust a move. See? There it is. Judgment. See? The fool. They're going to have to, what you won't do, do for Scorpios. So, yes, yeah, like what they probably wouldn't do for nobody else, honey. Don't make them. I'm telling you, this is someone here coming in. Your soulmate is about to do something towards you that they have never done for anyone else else but some of y'all have earned it okay for this person you've earned your stripes you've earned your stripes with a tough one is what i feel so let's see what you don't see because this is how somebody looking at you what you don't see is that if you stand on business you stand on ground and you know you deserve better it's slowly coming your way you're about to be happy with the results you're going to get something worth a empress having and you ain't going to have to fuss and fight to get it. It's almost like you done went through this course. You done took this major, uh, you know, you done took this major leap in life, you know, where you had to show somebody by walking away. And as a result, it's going gonna, it's gonna to get you what you want. All right. You're about to get what you want, child. Because somebody ain't sleeping. They said they, they said they didn't. They, they, this person count to a million. <laughs> this person count sheep to a million. And they still wide awake. See? Ooh, so let's see. What's up with this Queen of Swords? What Scorpio don't see? Now, what's up with this Nine of Swords? What do Scorpios don't see? I don't know if I said don't see or don't know. What you may not be expecting. Now, what you don't see. This is what's happening behind. I feel like what Spirit is showing you is when you chose yourself and you pulled back, let me show you what's happening as a result of you choosing you and knowing who you are. You're going to move some things. Now, see, somebody lonely and somebody could be worrying about your status, too. Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. Somebody worried because they know that you see Scorpios. Somebody's scared that they have missed out. Somebody's not happy without you. See, because somebody thought that they could treat you like anything and y'all had to show them by how you was going to allow it or not all you had to do is just walk away and stand on that and i feel like y'all are and that now look at them you can't come no empress with this so this is why they feeling some type of way because somebody feels like you done moved on away from their mess their ego tripping so i'm telling you spirit is just showing you what you don't see is that you did the right thing if you chose you and you you're not you're not you know what i'm saying you're not waiting on them you're not chasing them you're loving you because that's going to get somebody's attention so what's up with the two of cups for Scorpio? What Scorpio don't see? Two of cups. Soulmate, partnership, connection, love. The world. Completion, cycle. So it could be, see, and they go to sun, your rewards, and they go to freaking star card again. See, wishes about to come true. See, see, Scorpio, for some of y'all, you had to walk away in order to get it. Because look, they go to Ten of Cups. See? Some of y'all, you had to walk away and choose yourself and stand on that in order for you to get it. Somebody may be used to you always coming back. And I feel like y'all choosing y'all self. It may have been a hard thing for you because you probably was in love with this person. But I feel like you at this point now where you're not going to let nobody walk over you. This is what's happening behind the scenes. What you don't see. Things are healing behind the scenes. Uh, you're about to be very, very happy. You got the nine of cups as well as the star card twice, especially if you Scorpios are in that feminine, very sedity, very picky, very choosy, as you should be very selective, very mindful, very thoughtful of who gets your attention. God dang it, because you're special. You're not from here. <laughs> you can't hook up with no peasants. And so someone is recognizing that you ain't playing. And if they really want you, they're going to have to come right. Or they're going to have to stress out for the rest of their life. All right? Because it's going to be a life sentence. <laughs> queen of Swords. What's up with this Queen of Swords? For Scorpios, clarify the Queen of Swords. Three of Pentacles, the strength card. Somebody's trying to build the courage up to come back to face you. But they know they're going to have to meet you halfway. You could have a Leo. Like I said, if somebody was not in agreement, somebody was selfish, all about their selfish needs and what they want, all of that's going to change. That is, if they want to come to you, because they already know this. See, <laughs> they're going to have to they're going to have to get off the porch. They're going to have to take the they're going to take the training wheels off. God dang it. Because you're dealing with a whole missus here. Eight of cups. See, somebody wants your attention. 
somebody's worried that you you've let them go for real you walked away completely for real because they know it was one-sided and you tired of feeding them could be an aries see four swords somebody's coming out somebody's coming off of the break somebody's coming out of stagnation out of separation they're gonna make the move and let them do not chase them, honey. They come to you, and then you can decide if you want them or not. Don't you don't you you know the emperor don't chase? Cause when they come, they're gonna come and, and do what they're supposed to do. Apologize, bearing gifts. Take your hat off when you're in the presence of a goddess. What's wrong with you? Your mama and dad ain't taught you. You don't be standing in front of no emperors with your hat on. Matter of fact, get out. You're supposed to come in from the back anyway. <laughs> You should have stayed in the car, little boy. <laughs> yeah, Knight of Pentacles. What's up with this Knight of Pentacles coming in to Scorpio? What Scorpio don't see with this Knight of Pentacles coming in to be stable and solid? See, this is a gift because you remember you got, see, there it is. Page of Cups, but this time around, the second time around. They're going to do what it takes to secure a commitment with you this time because somebody don't want you keep on ghosting and cussing them out. <laughs> They're going to look you in your face. So we go together, right? So you my woman, right, Scorpio? I'm your man. All right, we go together. Okay, you see me? We go together. <laughs> they said, don't cuss me out no more. Oh, somebody's coming out of indecisiveness. They're coming out of denial. Someone's about to face their fear. They're slowly coming to you and they're coming in with a real stable offer. You're going to be happy with this. Somebody's coming in because they miss you. Somebody's coming in because they love you. And somebody's coming in because they don't want to miss out on a good thing. Ten of swords. See, I feel like a lot of this person's dirty deeds may be catching up on them or whoever you were with. It could have been, you know, their lifestyle that was holding them back. They were trying to keep control over things. Somebody may was trying to control you by taking their time about, you know, how somebody wants to get everything, but, you know, don't give in. But once again, they're going to balance the scales at the Ace of Pentacles because there is a new opportunity here. So now you have the Ace of Cups and the Ace of Pentacles with the soulmate. You definitely have soulmate energy coming in here. And please believe whoever you had to put your foot down and you think that they're going on with their life and they all that they're not. Uh, but but don't you be waiting and don't you be looking backwards, God damn it. You keep on moving forward here. Stand on there because if you give in too soon and if they have not really did the proper spiritual work, then it's just going to go back to the same thing. But somebody owes you an apology, Scorpio. Nine of Cups. What's well, Scorpio don't see? See, look at that card. Just plop right on out. Look at that. See? Nine of Cups. Two of Cups. There it is again. But there goes the King of Pentacles. Ooh, a boss. Could be a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. Somebody here. Somebody could be looking at you like, you know, like, like they want to uh, invest. They want to build something with you. Take a leap of faith, offering you some type of commitment. Because see, there go the Knight of Pentacles. There they go again. See? See? And there go the Queen of Cups. See? Because you the Empress. See? Somebody want to make you happy, Scorpio. I feel like somebody want to take care of you because you got the King of Pentacles with a C. Because once again, somebody's finally waking up and answering the call. See? There go judgment. Somebody's finally making up their mind that they're in love and they want to explore you. They want to make it right and they know they've been wrong. They know you mad. They know you done cussed them out. They know you done spoke your truth and they know that every word you said was the truth. So somebody knows that you're worth way much more than what they showed you. And if you give them a chance, Scorpio, this will somebody want to prove to you. Why is the page of cups here? Clarify the page of cups for Scorpio. Page of cups. An apology, innocent, innocent conversation. See? Just that somebody may call you or talk to you very, very humble, very sweet and gentle. Somebody don't want to fuss. Somebody don't want you to cuss them out. They don't want to pull that queen of swords out of you, see? Because somebody know that they didn't treat you right and they know you deserve better of them. There she is again. The empress, see? You got Libra, Libra all up in here, see? Somebody's going to come back in and make it right towards you, Scorpio, because somebody can't get over you. This is what you don't see. Somebody's going to treat you like you are royal. See? Six of Pentacles. There it is. You got the King of Pentacles, see? Somebody's coming back in to spoil you, Scorpios. Maybe somebody was confused. 
Somebody's having a major epiphany about you. Somebody's having a major realization about you. Someone's having a major wake up call about you. The tower and the seven of cups, see? Somebody realized that they ain't going to find nobody better than you out of everybody in the world with that seven of cups. You're the number one. You're, wait, wait, wait. Mm -hmm. You're number one in my book. You're number one in somebody's book, goddamn. You better listen to Gladys Knight. Now you got the ace of cups. Somebody can see themselves having a family with you with that empress, that queen of cups. Somebody feels like you're very loving and nurturing and forgiving. And so they know if you pissed off, they must be wrong because somebody feel like you're always a good energy here. You're always calm and soothing and lovable. So if you're out of character, it's because somebody pushed you in there because you're not like that, you know, any other time because you're in the Queen of Cups. So, yes, yeah, something you have waited on. See, Ace of Cups. There it is. Look at all that poor. Y'all, somebody's going to be so happy here. Look at that, moving forward, overcoming obstacles, moving forward could be a cancer for some of y'all. And for some of y'all, this is what you manifest. A little do you know what you manifest and what you want wants you back. Because for some of you guys, the person you want and you waiting on is watching you and waiting for you too. They go to page of source, see? This person, never, this, this person may be watching you, asking around about you. Why is the star here for Scorpio? Well, Scorpio don't see with the star. What does Scorpio not see between their love relationship with the star? Your wishes coming true, healing a connection, healing your broken heart, healing your wounds, healing your disappointments. See, somebody coming in to put their work in, see? Because you got somebody's undivided attention here, Scorpio, because now somebody here has finally seen the light. Somebody's had a mental breakthrough and somebody wants to start over with integrity the right way. Because once again, this person's been having conflict. They ain't been able to move on away from you. Six of Cups, and I feel like some, somebody running away from conflicts and they running to you. So for some of y'all, somebody is tired of uh, the people who they used to be around is full of mess, full of lies and deceit, which pulled this person away from you. But for some of you guys, when you pulled yourself away from this person, it made this person want you more and it put them back on the right track because you pulled yourself out of it. And when you pull yourself out of there, you end up looking like the person that's the most mature. But anybody that continue to stay in a toxic situation, it's like it's nothing to set them apart. But you proved to, to this person who you are, Scorpios. And like I say, this person sneaking away from somebody else for somebody. It's like they ain't going to say nothing. It's going to look up and they're going to be with you. <laughs> Why is the Empress here? Profile the Empress for Scor what Scorpio don't see with this Empress. <clears throat> You win, Scorpios. You're the winner. You're the one that won somebody hard. And some of y'all, y'all finally got somebody here at the street, somebody here who finally ready to settle down with somebody. See? King of Swords. See? Could be a Libra, Gemini, an Aquarius, a Libra. See, that's why you and the Queen of Swords energy towards this person, because maybe they were acting cold. But somebody missed that. So that's why somebody coming in to give you what you want, because somebody's put some time in with you. Somebody feels comfortable with you. Somebody feels your love. They know you're genuine. This person could have been around fake folks and they go to hangman. See, this king of swords is changing the way that they view things now because they're going through major awakenings. Major shifts are changing. The wheel is here. And when you move yourself out the way, it's going to highlight that you are the one. See, they know you ain't playing no games. See, I tell you, this person got more respect for you than you know. Because everybody else staying around, but you now, you like, uh, who you think you is? Y'all you, gave this person a run for their money, Scorpio. And see, you're the reason why they are awakening. See, there go judgment. See? So it's almost like y'all ain't got to worry about it. If your soulmate or your person did you wrong, they're going to get it right back. A spirit's chest tasks this person because they know better. That's what spirit is telling this person. They know better. If they pulling this queen of swords out of you because they in the king of swords, when they know that this is who you are, then spirit going to get them. And this is why they're coming back. Because somebody can't find that. They can't replace you. This person is broken that you don't want to be with them now because they probably broke your heart. So for some of y'all, in order to get everything you've always wanted, just pull back and act like you love yourself, but mean it. And when and if it's the right person, they're going to they chase you. You ain't going to have to wonder if they really for you. You don't want some. <coughs> <Ooh. coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Somebody may have had block communication. 
where their throat chakra was closed because of pride and arrogance. But this judgment card is breaking free somebody, okay? This is somebody about to express a lot of things to you because I feel like you've been open and honest and very, very opinionated. But some of you guys, you standing up for yourself is exactly what you need to do with a particular person like this that's acting like they ain't bothered because I guarantee you they are bothered because they are in love, all right? So that's your reading, Scorpio, is what you do not see coming with your person. Please like, share, and subscribe.